Switching from Android to iPhone is exciting. New phone, new features. But what about your WhatsApp chats? Years of messages, photos, videos. You can't lose all that. Many people fear losing their WhatsApp data when switching. But don't worry. In this video, I'll show you exactly how to transfer all your WhatsApp data from your Android phone to your new iPhone completely and easily. If you haven't subscribed my channel yet, please subscribe now. The first method is the official and free way using Apple's Move to iOS app. This transfers most of your data, including WhatsApp, directly from your Android phone to your iPhone. Important, your iPhone needs to be in the initial setup process. If you've already set it up, you'll need to factory reset it. This will erase everything on your iPhone, so back it up first if possible. On your Android phone, download and install the Move to iOS app from the Google Play Store. On your iPhone during the setup process, choose Move Data from Android. Follow the on-screen instructions on both phones. They'll connect via a temporary Wi-Fi network. Select WhatsApp on your Android phone when prompted. This prepares your WhatsApp data for transfer. Keep both phones close and connected to power during the entire process. Once the transfer is complete, install WhatsApp on your iPhone and log in with the same phone number. You'll be prompted to import your chats. Tap Start and all your messages and media will appear. But what if your iPhone is already set up and you don't want to erase it? In that case, you'll need a third-party tool. One popular option is Tenorshare iCareFone Transfer. This is a desktop application, so you'll need a computer. Download and install iCareFone Transfer on your computer. Connect both your Android phone and iPhone to your computer. Follow the software's instructions. You'll likely need to enable USB debugging on your Android phone and create a backup of your WhatsApp data. The software guides you through this step by step. iCareFone allows you to transfer WhatsApp data without resetting your iPhone, which is a huge advantage. It can also transfer data from GBW WhatsApp to standard WhatsApp. It's generally faster than the move to iOS app and has a high success rate. However, it's not free. You'll need to purchase a license. Now here's a relatively new official method that doesn't require you to reset your new iPhone, linking it as a companion device. This is perfect if you want to use WhatsApp on your new iPhone alongside your Android, or if you just need to access your chats quickly without moving the entire history. On your new iPhone, download and open WhatsApp. When prompted for your phone number, don't enter it. Instead, tap the Link a Device option, usually found by tapping Yeesh, or register another device. A QR code will appear. Now, on your Android phone, go to WhatsApp settings linked devices and scan the QR code on your iPhone. Your iPhone will now sync and display all your current and future chats. The catch? It won't transfer your old chat history from Android to iPhone. It acts more like WhatsApp web, but on your phone. So, which method is right for you? Move to iOS, free, official, transfers full history, but requires a factory reset of your new iPhone. Best for brand new iPhones out of the box. Link as companion. Free, no reset needed, quick setup. But it doesn't transfer old history to your iPhone's local storage. Your Android remains the primary device. Great for temporary use or having WhatsApp on both phones. Third-party tools, like iCareFone. Paid, but no iPhone reset needed transfers full history, and generally more reliable for existing iPhones. Best for established iPhones, where you want a complete primary transfer. No matter which method you pick, always keep both phones fully charged and connected to a stable Wi-Fi network. Don't interrupt the transfer. And be patient. It can take some time with a lot of data. You can choose the one that fits your situation best and have everything transferred smoothly. If this video helped you, please give it a thumbs up, subscribe for more easy tech guides, and share it with anyone switching phones. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.